Well, it's Monday. We're back here at Core Fitness to talk about getting you in shape and more importantly, healthy, right? Right. And we're talking more about cardio and the specifics of cardio and some kind of different um, exercises that you can do because maybe if you've been doing cardio for a long time, you don't want to get bored. And if you're not bored, then you'll stick to something long. Right, right. So we had spoken before that a minimum of about 200 minutes of cardio a week is very important to your health. Um, anything that's going to raise your heart rate and your lung capacity is considered a cardio exercise. So specifically today, I wanted to talk about interval training, um, the difference between high and intensity interval training and regular interval, interval training. And what I have here, um, this is my timer. Okay. And so interval training basically goes on a time set. And so you could choose maybe a minute or 50 seconds. And you're going to do an exercise that's going to raise your heart rate for that time. Then a beeper will go off and you're going to take a rest. And that doesn't mean you're going to stop. That just means you're going to walk or you're going to slow down, do a simple step touch or something that's going to bring your heart rate back down and then you're gonna go right back into that. So that's your basic regular interval training. But where, there's also something called HIT, which is like a new tag word. Um, HIT stands for high intensity interval training. And that's where you're going all out maximum effort for a very short amount of time and you're dipping into your anaerobic zone. So that's really good for blasting fat. Oh, I was just gonna ask, so if, if you're used to doing a certain kind of uh, cardio and you do this, is this for someone who's at a plateau or is this for anybody? Yeah, usually I see um, when you're stuck at a plateau, this is what I'll recommend because when you're at a plateau, you've been doing the same routine usually for a long time and you get on your treadmill and you're there for 40 minutes and you wonder why you know, nothing is happening. So mm -hmm. you can crank that up and an interval doesn't necessarily have to be walking, running. Um, it could be jumping rope. It could be um, power lunges or it could just be anything like walking steps really fast. If you have a good set of steps in your house, you can sprint up those and come back. Do that maybe five times and that's one interval and you would do that set a couple times. You have a grand opening coming up. We do. April 25th, 26th and 27th. Um, we have our grand reopening uh, to celebrate the expansion here at Core Fitness. And so if you have any questions, we have um, staff will be here and we'll be offering free classes all weekend. You have actually someone special coming here for the re-grand opening. Right. Um, it's called Girls on Guard and it's a woman's only specific um, self-defense class. And so he will be offering a trial class for that. And you can stop by on Friday to sign up for the class. And um, we, we want to welcome them. It's, All right. It's, it's exciting. exciting. I, you know, always keep your workouts, uh, have a variety of different things going on. Not only cardio, but we talked about uh, strength training. Next Monday, we're going to talk specifically about how you can use weights to lose some weight. Correct. All right. Join us right here at Core Fitness on your community on FYI.